this video is going to be about how I recognize and execute the pi set for CLL. So for pi, it's really simple on recognition. You only have to look at the top face because they're, the yellow is all on the side. So you only have to look at the top face for uh, the pi set. So how I recognize this first case is these two are opposites and there's a block right here. So these two are opposites and here's a block. And then I just do. For this one, it's the exact opposite. The block was here before and the opposite colors were here. But now the opposite colors are right here and the block is right here. So I just recognize block here, opposites right there. Hold it here and do this. For this case, I recognize this as these two diagonal ones are opposite and these two diagonal ones match. So diagonal and opposites are here. So matching diagonal, opposite diagonal. And I do this. For this one, it's the exact opposite of the last case. Before these two are the same and these two are opposite. Now these two are opposite and these two are the same. So same, opposite. And I hold this one like this. So. The next case is very easy to recognize. It's just a checkerboard pattern as you can see. Opposite, opposite. So it's just, it's just a checkerboard pattern on top. It's not too hard to recognize. And then I do this. The final case is this. There's a solid block of color right here and a solid block of color right there. So orange, red. And then I have two algs for this. Um, this one. There's that. And then this one. I use both of them equally, so yeah. So that's how I recognize and execute the uh, pie set for CLL.